What's up guys, it is Brad, or Demon Asylum here, I'm bringing you all a new Fallout 4 video. Gonna be showing you another unique weapon location within the Far Harbor DLC. This is for Sergeant Ash, it is a flamethrower. So you guys are gonna wanna go to Acadia on your map, you're gonna end up coming here no matter what, as it is part of the main story of the DLC, but you can choose to come here earlier on, I do believe. Either way, when you get here, you're gonna be coming through this front door, and if it's your first time here, you may need to come up and talk to uh, Dima before you're actually able to bar with anybody in this place or get side quests from them but once you've talked to him to progress the story of the dlc quest you're going to want to come down here and you're going to be looking for the npc that is named did jen i believe yep here he is usually he's going to be behind this counter but he may be around in a different spot Go ahead and choose to barter with him. As soon as he lets you, you may have to have a bit of a conversation with him first. Then you're going to want to go over to the weapon section, of course, and scroll down until you guys end up seeing a Sergeant Ash. So let's go ahead and check it out. Sergeant Ash, 20% chance to cripple the target's leg. As you can see, again, it is a flamethrower. Damage down in the bottom left-hand corner is 13. The fuel, of course, is just the same for the flamethrower. Uh, fire rate is 90. Range is 47. Accuracy is 53. Weight is 16.1. And value, which is what you'll be spending to get this gun from him, is 764. In the bottom right-hand corner, you can see the four current mods the gun has on it. When you purchase it, you have standard tank, standard barrel, standard propellant tank, and then standard nozzle. Of course, you're going to have a handful of different mods that you can choose from to switch out for this gun but that is what it starts with and uh, that is all you guys need to know so that is going to be it for this video if you have any questions go ahead and drop them in the comment section if you guys have enjoyed this video or found it helpful feel free to drop a like on it down below and subscribe for many more fallout 4 videos to come thanks for watching everyone and peace out